I heard this thing once, yeah, on telly. Six degrees of separation it was about. Whoever you are, up, down, high, low, you know someone who knows someone who knows anyone else on Earth. Except, if you want the ugly truth, some of us ain't so connected, are we? Have you seen Heston? I need a consult on a patient. Uh, uh, no, our uh, daughter Carter has left for the day. A local authority conference. Where is it? This patient. Oh, yeah, thanks. Yeah. For your mother. Yes, she's very ill. Uh, no, the police can deal with you. Some of us are looking at the stars. I want it. I just need someone to give me a chance. But it's always no. Uh, not today. Keith! Oi! You hear me? I've got a bug or something. Yesterday was slow anyway. <laughs> so get cracking then. Get out there and do some cards. I'm not carrying you. Or do you need a hand? Nothing doing. Just won't be at each other. Again. But you learn to mind your own. Don't you? Business as usual. Not that I feel that sexy today. Do as I'm told, though, eh? Just not right now. All right. I was until I had some skanky loser in my way. Yeah, I'm a bitch. So is life. Mopping up other people's mess. But working. Excuse me, uh, Mr. Carl Tobin. Your previous GP. Your last doctor, we need an address. The usual drill. Keep your doc trying not to choke at all the bumps and scrapes. STDs. Come in. Uh, in case you need some more. Thank you. Sorry about your carpet. No, it is a small stain. It will clean up. It's positive. One word for it. So? So can I have a fix-it pill? Not here, at the clinic in Derby Street. Up to nine weeks. I'm eight. OK. There are other options. Oh, yeah. Imagine me playing happy families. Well... You could take a day to think about it. I have, all right. I'll take the pill. OK. We've got some clinic cards somewhere. I'll just be a minute. Sorry, sorry, busy, busy day. 
Seems like the whole world needs its ears syringing. Yeah, can we go on? Of course. Sorry, there's me yattering on. You've probably got your own work to be getting on with. Not till I find some. That's why I need a blood test, so... Seems a bit extreme. Um. OK, if you'd like to take your jacket off. Why? Need to check your vitals. For the record. Stupid system won't let me do anything till I dot all the eyes and cover. So, no look on the work front. Wonder why that is. Could dress smarter. I am a shirt. Unusual. Lawyer's asking for a HIV and drug screening. A parole officer's idea. Ah, what were you? Aggravated with? burglary, three years, just out. Anything else you need to know before I get my blood test? Oh, sorry, have you got any cards for the Derby Street Clinic? Um, yes, yes. Um, should put a CV together. Someone's bound to snap you up. The look on her face. <laughs> the look on her face. Maybe I can help. You can talk to me about anything. Nothing you say will leave this room, I promise. Do you know who the father is? All right. Do you want to keep it? No! What am I going to do with the kid? What sort of a life would it have? We can find a way through together. All I'm saying is you have choices. Choices? Yeah, right. Playing safe, have you? Have you? And then you've been with me. No, I always use something. Except with you. Only with you. It's you and me, babe. It always has been. And we've got to get out sometime, haven't we? <laughs> Are you cracked? Playing mum? You? <laughs> and what sort of mum are you going to be, huh? You can't even do this right. You have one thing to remember. Don't let them knock you up. Dick, I didn't. You're not hearing me. I can't do it again. You can, I can't. and you will. Go get your pill, and then you get back to the horse. Simple enough for you. Don't you dare cry. Don't. Just get it down, you stupid, useless. All right. I mean, still, buy a cup of tea. Doesn't give up, does he? I've seen you around, so I just wanted to introduce myself, proper. I mean. But I'm not feeling too chatty now. Just something stuck in my throat. Call me anything, as long as you call me. 
Yeah, a Renan. You've probably got loads of mates, and yeah, proper life. Don't have to go scraping the barrel. Nice girl like you. But that's all right. You, you, you don't have to say nothing if you don't want. I just wanted to say, I like seeing you around. You know? Gives us a reason to get up in the morning. And I think there's something better out there. If that's how you want it, I can do this. Do it with my eyes closed. Come on. When you don't want to chuck up, it's easy. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, no, 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 it's gone, you stupid cow. Down the pan like everything else. Who's going to fix it now, eh? Hi, just... Just wanted to see how you're doing. If you found the clinic okay. If you've taken your tablet yet. <laughs> no. I've lost it. Right. You know you can come back at any time if you want to talk. If you're having second thoughts. No. You don't know what it's like. Maybe things can be different this time, Kira, if you want. I've read your notes. Everything. If you can get yeah, through yeah. all that, maybe... Yeah, you come, mate. She should be back any minute. What? Key, you're looking for business, yeah? Uh, no, um, I, I just wanted to borrow an iron. Oh, yeah? Time waster. <laughs> Coming in here and mucking me about. I'm a busy man, mate. No, I, I Say I please, then. Magic word, come on. Well, you're after something, yes, nicely, don't you? I want to hear it. Please. Can I borrow an iron? No. <laughs> whoa, 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 all right, all right. I can see you're down in your look, so I'll bung you a freebie. How's that? <laughs> as long as you make sure she uses something. Silly bitch keeps forgetting. <laughs> Treat her rough if you like. She needs a little reminder. Learn her place, yeah? Oh, yeah. Where's that then? Bottom of the pile, mate. Right under you. It's gonna be okay. He won't hurt you.
Dak? I can do this. Let me see. Come, please. You saw this before. Why? Why are you? You need help. What's your name? Rose. I'd find you. Where are you going to go? <laughs> You're nothing without me. You need me, Key. And I need you, babe. It has now become an emergency. Uh, Dr. Clay! Oh, what have you done? Oh. 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 Right, come on, let's get him through to your room. Oh, come on. I haven't got all day. All right. Places to go, people to do, yeah. What are you, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you, what are you doing? Maybe you'll get out. <laughs> I am. The police can deal with you. Please, please. I am not lying. My mother, she is very sick. She has pulmonary hypertension. I... I, I cut the Viagra into small doses as a vasodilator. If you are not lying, then you are mad. These are, are dangerous drugs, only to be used by a, a trained medical professional. I am a doctor. I am trained in Lagos and Abuja. I don't know, it could work in theory. <sighs> Just... <laughs> sorry, sorry. Yeah, the problem is the skin is still attached to the collar. Ah! Sorry, sorry. Okay, right, we're gonna need some tramadol for the pain. Your keys? Um, I don't know what I've done. Don't worry, I'll get my keys. Thought you'd put your stupid days behind you. 
Has it gone? No. No, it's still there. No, 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 no. Yes. I can't I know, live. I know, I know. But it is just skin. Right. Listen, I want to help you, but you're going to have to trust me. Where are they, parking the panda? Well, uh, Constable Giles was less than happy when I explained it was a, a case of a mistaken identity. You what? One hooded individual looks very much like another. Thank you. Am I missing something here? I think we both are. Perhaps it is us who should be thanking you. Dr. Tyler's patient had, had a serious illness. You diagnose my patient? Schizosomiasis is common in Nigeria. I, I saw the lesions on her arms. That is why one good turn deserves another. Uh, now that we have the drugs that accidentally fell into your bag, you must let Dr. Tyler examine your mother. Looks nasty. Yeah. What do you reckon? Second, third degree? So they might have to remove the bad skin and, and graft new on top? Ah, uh, no. The doctors will try and save everything that they can. It's worth saving. Personal taste aside. Yeah, but what if someone was to give the A&E docs a nudge to do it? I mean, if you knew someone at St Phil's, or Heston did, you could put in a good word. I'd do it myself, but um, I miss the last surgeon's ball, so... Uh, in theory, yeah, if there was consent. Right, well, hopefully you're through the worst of it now. Tramadol should be kicking in soon. Should make you feel a lot better. Yeah. It's starting to... Yeah. Not long now. All be over before you know it. No more hassle. No more sleepless nights. No more reasons to get up. Just sleep. Ladies and gentlemen, Owen has left the building. Today is the day. I still don't know how you've managed this far with Viagra. Necessity. We do what we must. I've got warfarin and a nebulizer. Should make things easier. It's just a question of finding the right balance. But now you know if you need any more help, you can always come back. Thank you. Honey, honey. Are they illegal too? I became a doctor to care for those in need, whatever the circumstances. Some of us are looking at the stars. does it all end? Thank you. And what was the point? You know, for giving me a chance. Well, probably have scars. <laughs> Who cares? I'm gonna get another tattoo to cover it anyway. A rose. Are there six degrees separating us? Doctor. Or seven? Thank you. Or one? Well, how long have you got? Truth is, I don't know. Oh, you mate. Are you all right? 
Don't wimp out on me now. You were all talk before. You look like you could do with a hot cup of tea. Yeah. Six sugars, Tom. I'm buying. Last one didn't taste too good. This one. All I know is when someone reaches out, it feels good. I can handle it, alright? I know it makes you wonder why you didn't get into colonic irrigation. <clears throat> Dr. Cassidy, you're a GP with five years training and a 20 years experience and not an inconsiderable salary. Do you think your time may be better spent on patients who are actually ill? Is that for No. No, it isn't. How did that go? Not a clue. 